And the letter ends, I yearn for the day when you shall return to me, my sweet Henry, yours now and forever, Sarah. As we can see from the desperation in Sarah's tone, the Civil War put a great strain on relationships. Uh, excuse me, that letter didn't sound desperate, it sounded sweet. The next letter is dated four months later, which shows that Henry was not eager to respond. He was in battle. Sometimes guys take a while to respond to messages. When they're in battle. Henry writes, All right, great, Sarah. Looking forward to seeing you too. To which Sarah responds, Dearest Henry, are you mad at me? Now we can see Sarah's not picking up on the fact that Henry is just not into her. How do you know he's not into her? He said he couldn't wait to see her. Henry responds, No, just busy. To which Sarah replies, Are you sure? You seem mad. And Henry replies, Can't talk. At war. This is so stupid. The only thing this proves is that Sarah is more expressive with her emotions, which is normal for women. Henry never wrote to Sarah again. However, historians found a letter addressed to Bethany, another woman from Henry's hometown. Hey, sexy, you got that thickness like strawberry milkshake. Credits. He was in battle. 